today's topic um topic ya leo ni how to build a celebrity brand hiyo ndio topic ya leo sijui kuisema na Kiswahili i don't know nani anaweza nisaidia na Kiswahili huyu mtoto wa nje ya ndoa nje ya ndoa ama ni wapi eh hiyo mtu semaje na Kiswahili how to build a celebrity brand Nani sisi data? Nani atamsaidia? Ali tuende kidogo tafadhala. Jinsi ya kujenga brand ya mtu maarufu. Brand ya mtu maarufu. Yes. Um kuna different ways za watu kuwa maarufu na Saina lenga sana the artists If you want to be an artist kuna vitu ambavyo unafaa kupitia before u, 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 ufike or maybe utoke because huku Tanzania unasema sana ti mimi nataka kutoka but then again ni njia gani unataka kutoka Sana sana na una Tanzania watu wanafanya kiki na most of my interviews msema kiki ni kitu ambayo utafanya siku moja ufikirie tu alafu ifanyike then kesho what will happen tomorrow Uta, kazi yako itakuwa kufikiria kiki uh, other than kufikiria lyrics za wimbo wako tunafikiria okay kesho nitafanya kiki gani kesho mtu anakifanya kiki gani for example kuna msanii mmoja hapa alikuja kwangu anataka kutoa ngoma nataka kutoa song akaniambia ti Beatrice mimi nataka kutoa kiki kwanza ni ah uh, tuajue mimi na date tu msichana kwa sababu ni popular nini so nikamwambia okay sawa kijo mmedate alafu lazima tena utaplan vile mta, mta break up how you will break up kwa sababu tena hiyo ni kiki nyingine but then again hiyo ni mimi wana ni kama kiki is a temporary thing ambayo ikiisha what will you do next kazi yako itakuwa tu kufikiria kiki but what you're supposed to do ni to make sure that your talent inaongea talent yako ndio inafaa kuongea more than kiki because uko nje for example in america in canada in wherever hawajui kiki ni nini only tanzania ndio wanajua kiki ni nini because hata hata kenya yenyewe mi I got to know Kiki huku. I did not know Kiki ni nini because Kenya pia tufanye vitu. But huku naona inafanyika sana. But then again, ukifanya Kiki, for example, ukifanya Kiki useme, "Mi today nataka kusema nililala na huyu msichana ndio nitoke." What if someone anataka kukuendorse na yuko America, alafu one huyu mtu alikuwa amelala na huyu alafu kulikuwa na story. So umeshajiaribia. Do you understand me? Nani elewa? Yes. Umejaribia kwa wale watu walikuwa wanataka kupatia endorsement deal na yet ulikuwa unafikiri unatengeneza. So sometimes kiki is not the best of things. The best thing ni ku use your talent to get to where you want to be. Tumia kipaji chako, tumia what Mungu amekupatia ndio ufike pale unataka kuwa kufika. So unafanyaje ndio ufike hapo bila kiki? The first thing that you should do ni ku invest in people. Invest in people. Watu ni very very yani people are very important sana sana sana. For example, um what's the magic name for me? Chadi boy. Chadi boy. for example, tume meet leo, yeah? Alafu u ukam kwangu useme hey, Beatrice nimesikia vile ume, umeongea nimependa to exchange contacts mimi niko na hii na hii unaweza nisaidia that is already investing in people you investing in me kwa hivyo mimi nitakukumbuka nikifika da nikaenda Kenya nikaenda Nigeria whatever i'll be thinking of you kwa sababu niambia kitu so that's investing in people uki invest na watu ndio watu watakukumbuka and they will give you things they will give you more than you thought you will get yeah so the first thing invest in people watu ambao unaona watakusaidia not everyone for example in dodoma right now nimefika dodoma 
and uh, of course I on AFM the best station in Dodoma I guess I'm um, going to apart from AFM I think I'm going to go to Mavunde and I'm going to go to Mavunde so say to challenge and come pick and come say sir, I'm in the dorm. Can we meet? Any other? I think Neil can have to remember to say number one. Ali ni ambetu. Hi Beatrice, how are you? And come I'm fine. I just came for training. The training AFM. Neza ku meet after. Then he said, Sir Beatrice, just come after. You're only investing in people. Cause sababu through people unapata something. Na sometimes si ati so na invest in people that you sasa umeona Beatrice unasema eh hey, Beatrice ndio ngia na yeye ni anze kubrandiwa immediately no una invest in people ndio wakukumbuke so that the next time unataka kuongea na yeye they will remember you all right so ni kitu ya kwanza invest in people watu ambao watakusaidia sio mtu tu yeyote people who will help you the second thing ambayo itawasaidia ni consistent content unaona watu wengi wanatoa content over and over again yeah na za patia na example ya nani mm, diamond for example diamond over and over again lazima atoe wimbo sometimes ata any anatoa tu anatoa tu why because ana invest in consistent content because content ndio inauza but sometimes when an artist anatoa tu content out of evil tu yani unaona tu mtu anatoa tu kitu tu na ni boring sometimes pia unaangalia hii content iko na nini na itasaidiaje na ita, ita will it help you to reach another level so investing in consistent content watu wakukumbuke toa hii wimbo leo after three months like not even three months yani kuwa consistent in what you're doing kama we ni rapper to a wimbo leo kesho hivi 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 naweza wapatia example ya someone who used to do that alafu sijui nini ili happen katikati darasa darasa alitoa wimbo akatoa yani tulikuwa tuna dance wimbo zake zote not in a bad way kwa sababu pia ameni approach so i know that something happened aliniambia Beatrice I want branding so shida ilikuwa nini shida ilikuwa consistency alitoa wimbo mbili ambazo zilikuwa very nice so alikuwa anafaa kuwa consistent in the content ameona watu wanapenda hii watu wanapenda hii so endelea hivyo hivyo usi change because once you change you will fall so consistent content is very very important kama watu wanakuju kama umejibrand hivi hivi ndio watu wananifahamu then don't change ni kama tuseme diamond tume, okay let's talk about tuseme Vanessa Vanessa ama Nandi tuseme Nandi. Nandi anaimba kwa me I love her songs. Unaona anaimba alafu kesho tuone ana rap. Eh? Simtashanga. The next thing that you're supposed to do ni ku invest in social media. Social media ni very 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 important. Sub social media ndio inasema kila kitu kukuhusu. Unaona sometimes unaweza kuta mtu ni msanii anataka kutoka lakini unaona kila anapost hata yani at, yani ataingiani na kile na mziki yake unaona anapost hata vitu hata hazina maana but when i forget that you're supposed to build a brand you're supposed to get endorsement deals you're supposed to be a, a big brand so unazaje kwa big brand kama hata social media unapost vitu azieleweki so when you when you want to grow na unataka brand yako ikuwe kubwa social media is king lazima upost vitu ambazo zinaonesha you as a celebrity you as a as an artist and the first thing that you should do go and take a photo shoot kwani photo shoot kwa shinga squeeze kuna smartphones use your phone kama uwezi afford a mtu i mean a, a photographer ambia rafiki yako akupige picha vaa poa kali yani look good ambia rafiki yako akupige picha picha nyingi yani hata uombe nguo mahali enda enda kwa duka somewhere borrow clothes then take a picture hapo kwa store it doesn't matter go take pictures it's really very important alafu unazipost alafu kwa hizo pictures kuna kitu inaitwa um, uh, captions 
andika caption poa caption ambayo itaingiana na hiyo the picture ambayo umeweka usiandike ati oh what yani be very consistent in everything that you're doing usianze kuandika vitu hata make sense so pictures take pictures nini go snapchat hizo ma snapchat ma instagram nini ni instagram ni la ni snapchat ya instagram ni toaje insta story yeah is a vitu do something ambayo unakuonesha you are an artist yeah so those are the things that you're supposed to do on social media you need you need common knowledge you see rocket science ni kitu rahisi sana but naona watu wengi hawaelewi unaona mtu anaenda anaanza kuongea udaku udaku utakusaidia nini will it put food on your table aitaeka food on your table wale watu wanafaa ku focus on udaku ni presenters kwa sababu ndio wanakuambia they are supposed to research on it not you hiyo ni career yao career yao ni kumake sure umejua hii information whatever is going on in Tanzania or East Africa or Africa or the world kazi yako ni kutoa music yeah so build your brand through social media so number one, nilisema invest in people number two, nikasema consistency in content number three, nikasema promotions number four, nikasema social media so ya tano tunaingia into branding branding yourself um i think what wengi wa elewi branding ni nini Branding ni something very very important kwa kila mtu. Kila mtu whether you are an, whether when ni artist, when ni presenter, when ni manager, when ni CEO, branding ni important. Because vile unaji brand ndio watu watakuchukua. For example, ukuje kwangu alafu anze kulia. Mimi nitakuwa nasema mm, that cry baby kila saa nitakuwa nakumbuka tu ile mtu kazi yake tu ni kulia yet maybe hiyo ilikuwa the first is the first impression but branding yourself ni very important hiyo ndio inaonesha as i said inaonesha who you are when ni mtu wa aina gani na inaonesha watu watakuchukuliaje na ukishaji brand vizuri makampuni wataanza kukuona ukikuona wanakupatia endorsement deal ukipata endorsement deal guess what atuneza nunua nyumba because you'll get the money mshowe tunatafuta pesa si ndio so you get the money from endorsement deals utapata zile show uliko nataka kama AFM wana 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 and a show you'll be the first person to be called kwa sababu brand poor kama other stations in and I'm sure they'll be the, you'd be the first person ku, ku, kuitwa because you've branded yourself vile we unataka wanasema kama unataka kuwa CEO vaa kama CEO if you want to be amsani vaa kama msani mimi nikiangalia hapa ni sioni mtu amevaa kama msani to be honest i think ni manager tu wangu pale amejitahidi at least ana kama msani msani lakini like, yes, simsani but kwa you guys kitu kama hii something like this na mnajua someone in the branding field is wana, anakuja kuongelesha jitahidi go an extra mile hata kama ni kuomba nguo go an extra mile so that you show when in sani yeah sababu sani wako na certain look mimi nataka kuona hiyo certain look so that i ni ku differentiate wewe na watu wengine sasa imenipatia majina zenu only four people ndio nimeona majina zenu ndio zinakaa sana za wasanii but what about monekano tukitoka pale nje i wouldn't know that when msanii i wouldn't it takes just a simple thing jibrand vile unataka una kuwa yani jibrand to it doesn't take much ni kama unaenda sini salon unaenda kwa baba shop ukienda kwa baba shop unanyolewa nywele then unajua okay kama wewe ni msanii unafaa kwa maybe ya color brown color red kitu tu itaonesha hata kama ni kitu ndogo tu eka red mali hapa brown yellow whatever ionesha wewe ni msanii kwa sababu nikiona nywele ndio nitajua kwa sababu wanaume sana ni nywele wanaweka hizo rangi but then again you have to show you have to show that you yani wewe ni mtu nataka ku relate na, naye you understand 